Hello guys, Octo here and today I want to talk to you a bit about uh, one of the most uh, power consuming or performance draining settings from Witcher 3 Next Gen Edition specifically a setting which only affects the DirectX 12 version of the game This uh, dreaded setting has the name of Screen Space Reflection and uh, the difference between having this set on uh, low versus high is uh, enormous it's very impactful if you have a very old graphics card such as uh, pascal like uh, gtx 1060 which i personally tested with some time ago you will notice a very large performance drop so i was only getting uh, 30 or 40 frames per second with uh, this uh, option set to high and when i set it to low I immediately got up to 100 uh, frames per second. It makes a very large uh, difference. On the other hand, if you are using a much more powerful graphics card, what you will observe is that uh, this setting will uh, make the power draw of the card more than double. So in my uh, personal testing with the uh, RTX 4070, I'm running uh, limited uh, by G-Sync at uh, a bit under 120 frames per second. Standing in a certain uh, area in the game, I have a power consumption of 70, 80 watt with the setting on low. And as soon as I turn the uh, setting to high, it more than doubles going to 170 watt. This is very large and frankly, I don't know if uh, the graphical fidelity is enough to justify this uh, more than double increase to each uh, their own but to me this is a very very uh, i don't know unoptimized or inefficient setting to say the least which can make the difference between playable on unplayable on uh, older graphics cards and uh, of course uh, power consumption is also a factor which uh, it will make a very large difference on newer cards so please let me know if uh, you are unable to reproduce this although i highly doubt this is something that only i encounter and uh, also worth mentioning is that this is with uh, ray tracing disabled because with ray tracing enabled most probably the power consumption will max uh, anyway on your card and the performance will be significantly lower as well. And that's the way uh, Witcher 3 next gen is uh, optimized, or shall we say un unoptimized when using ray tracing.